guys, so this is going to be my monthly bathroom deep cleaning routine. I use these products once a month and once only. The rest of the weeks I use natural cleaning products, which I'll do a video on soon. So the first thing I do to get motivated and stay motivated is usually put some Pandora music on. These are my cleaning buckets. I don't use every product every time I take these around the house to clean, but I do bring them with me just in case so I don't have to keep running up and down the steps. I usually start off by using my Swiffer duster and dust around the corners of the walls and the vent that is at the top of my wall above the shower. Then I will go to the cabinet behind my toilet and dust that as well. Then I'll go to my light fixtures and medicine cabinet and dust those really well. Then I'll go get my cleaning gloves on so I don't get any product on my hands. And this is a Lysol bathroom cleaning product with 0% bleach, which I really liked about it. But like I said, I do use the harsh products once a month and this is one of them. So once I'm done spraying, I just let it sit for a little bit and I will go over to the sink with some disinfecting wipes and wipe the sink down. I ran out so I had to get more. And I usually wipe this down pretty good because my sink gets dirty. I actually do this every day, if not every other day. Depends on if I have time or not, but it definitely needs wiped down a lot. And then I'll use the Windex to clean my mirror and the medicine cabinet. And then I go back over to the tub with a sponge and scrub what is on there just so the smell doesn't hang around in the bathroom for a while. If it gets too bad, I will open a window just to let the air flow through, which I just did here because I sprayed a little bit too much. So I'm getting some ventilation in the bathroom. So then I just go back over to the tub and scrub some more. I feel like I'm always scrubbing the tub because it's stained at the bottom and I've used so many different products and cannot get the stain off. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but it's ugly and I just wish I could get it off and it never works out that way. So then I just scrub the walls of the shower and the shelves, make sure there's no soap residue or anything left on there. And I'm just using a cup for water to rinse off all the soap. And then I move over to the vanity and wipe that off a few times with disinfecting wipes. So then I move over to the toilet. Those two things that are on the top are from the baby proof locks that I had that Bernie broke twice. <laughs> and I can't get those two pieces off. I'm gonna have to use a tool to get them off. But the toilet usually gets pretty disgusting if I don't clean it every day or every other day, which here I did skip a day, so it was pretty gross, and I ended up doing the toilet twice. And then when I'm finished with the inside of the toilet, I will go on the bottom of the toilet and wipe that off and on the floor back behind the toilet as well. It tends to get pretty gross back there. And then I move over to the windowsill and wipe that down. That tends to get pretty dirty. And for some reason, I am wiping down the bathroom sink again with disinfecting wipes. I tend to clean things twice when I'm cleaning the bathroom just so I make sure that it is extra clean. And here's the part you guys are probably going to laugh at me about, but I do use my Swiffer to clean my walls in the bathroom because my bathroom gets little yellow drips of something that I have no idea what it is and it appears all over my walls and this is the only way for me to clean it not to mention the Swiffer pads that I use make my bathroom smell so good then when I'm done with the walls I get my shark vacuum and put it on the 
mode that you can use for bare floor and I vacuum the bathroom. So then to finish up my deep cleaning bathroom routine, I use my Swiffer again with some Febreze wet pads and that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you look out for my weekly bathroom cleaning routine and I will see you guys next time. Bye.